New pept is known as a nootropic, which is defined as a substance that is designed to enhance cognitive functioning. It affects acetylcholine levels and glutamate receptors in the brain via AMPA. AMPA kinds have a stimulant-like property, but do not produce the same effect as true stimulants. New pept increases nerve growth factor and BDNF, which are related to neuroplasticity. In 2019, in a study by Zainulina, found that it does not actually stimulate cell proliferation, however. Nupept also has anti-anxiety properties, but that's shown in rats only through the stimulation of dopamine and serotonin. Nupept is mostly studied in animals such as mice and rats. Note there are many examples of medications working in animals, but not in humans. In 2004, the FDA actually estimated 92% of drugs that passed preclinical tests, including pivotal animal tests, actually failed to proceed to market. It is also studied in individuals with mild cognitive impairments. I've not been able to find any randomized control trials in adult populations without cerebral damage of any sort. The most commonly cited article is from 2009 in a study by Gigi Nesmanov, which investigated 53 people with cognitive damage, 37 of which had vascular damage and 17 with post-traumatic damage. 41 of them completed the trial. They looked at two daily doses of 10 milligrams compared to the active control of pure acetam, which was 1,200 milligrams daily over 56 days. Nupept was more effective over 56 days of improving the mini mental status exam relative to pure acetam. Although when comparing all scores on the mini mental exam, BPRS and the CCSE, there was no significant difference. And this study did not look at comparison to placebo. In a study in 2011 by Amelin, it was an open perspective study that included 60 patients with stroke treated with Nupept in the first 12 months. An analysis of NMSC scores and lateral and categorical associations revealed the significant improvement of cognitive functions over two months in patients of the main group compared to the controls. Nupept is available in the US but not FDA approved. It is very inexpensive and actually banned in the UK. While there's a lot of claims online to suggest it improves various types of cognitive function, I'd rate this a two out of 10 in effectiveness based on D-level evidence in normal healthy adults.